Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for little sissy bitches, so your discretion is advised. We kill shit here. I come out to put the old Duke 650 out. I found a spot up here yesterday that I wanted to put it. I'm gonna put that in. Down that way I found some chewings, but I see I got one down here. For some reason he didn't go down the drowner. And he has tore this place up. Gosh dang, he's tore this place up. Had the little feed bed here. You see me catch some there previous years. I had to wait for the ice to leave and I got in here yesterday. I can see across there, I'll show it here in a minute, but you can see where they're going up and starting to cut the trees down. But while the ice was out on, they've been making, trying to make a, I think they're making a new den up in here. All I had was a caster mound. I'll, I'll probably remake it right over there. I can see where they've cut down a tree right there. Just wherever you can get it to where they're, get, make a slide or whatever. But I'll show you guys the remake. All right guys, while I'm waiting for him to expire, I just found this right here. This is a caster mound being started and it's got a beaver trap track in it. See, they cut this tree here. Kind of got a tunnel back through that way. I had a caster mound right there, previous. And then I got a dam here I need to break. Open some more. All right, stay tuned. I apologize for the wind in advance. It's pretty windy. It's a good sized beaver. I'm gonna come right here now. They tore up that area so bad. This is one of them deal times where I should have wore gloves. I just showed you down there what it looks like when they make a caster mound. Just put a bunch of mud up there. The bigger the pile, the better. should do it. It's a whole lot colder out here than I thought it was. Bridger number five. Yeah, my spring's messed up. 
and the uppins are pretty tough on a trap. There's a groove right here in the base plate. You got to have it. Your spring's got to be down in. Yeah, I should do it. very soft ground let's put my trap right here that's somewhat deep water they're gonna come in and investigate that I gotta order some more Jeff Dunlap's big pile but just the eye appeal will get them coming in there like the one I said yesterday didn't have anything either and I got a beaver this morning I don't know how many more are along here. But the more I get out, the better. All right, let's go get that 650 in. I think I'm gonna wait to break the dam when it's a little bit warmer. But I got a set around the corner that I had tripped from when I was coyote trapping. I finally broke the ice away. You can see all the ice, but I got it reset. That's the one I caught my hand in a while back. All right. I'll drag him up to the top and then I'll go down there and I'll show you where I seen that sign that I want to set. Pretty big beaver. I'm at Coyote Creek, by the way, guys. I'll leave him right there. I might put it right here. I just see how it goes. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Because they're definitely getting groceries right here. Doesn't look all that fresh. Well, that one down there is definitely fresh. I'm gonna find. Oh, there's a den. There's an older den right there of some sorts. Probably muskrat. I think anywhere right here is they're definitely eating some trees. They've been cutting on that tree, cut some trees there. I'm gonna put in a fake slide right here to this tree. I like to tell that they've been going up to it. They chewed all the bark off it and stuff. So a fake slide right here. Still pretty frozen. What a slide is, is this where they go in all the time? They start to wear a groove into the mud. And they'll just go in and out at the same spot every time.
And right here is where I went to trap. Where they step up on that slide. Get off of there. Cover up my trap tag. I'll put it right like this. Trap tag shiny, so it's being shiny. I need to get it covered up. And I'll probably bring some more in. I gotta make some more and then pull some in other places. But I know they're gonna go back to that tree. You can see they've been eating the bark off it. So now I should get them going up there. I need to put another one down there where all that other sign is. And I found that den there. I need to put a 330 in front of that. So uh, tomorrow I'll bring more traps in. I think I need to put another piece of wood right here, just a little bit. I don't know. Just to kind of hide my, I usually don't care about my rebar, but that'll help that. I don't know if you guys can make it out. They've cut a bunch of trees just right here. So I'm in a pretty heavy area. They're cutting on that side, cut there. They cut over that way. So there's definitely some activity right here. That's why I put the slide in right here. And I know they're going to that tree. So I just gotta get them going back to it. I think I'll walk this this way. Here's a tree that's been stripped of bark. Get nothing to the nope. Let's check check for uh 
den hoch. Yeah, it's probably underneath this right here a bit. There's a lot of cover right there for a nice den. More cuttings there. I don't feel any hard bottom here. It looks like there's a back door right here. Right here, another one. Yep, solid bottom. That's an escape route. Cool, you guys see that? There's a tunnel there and there's just one right there. Hopefully I'm helping somebody on how to locate them. I just give them a waders and go walking. Just be careful, you see how that just deeper there. Three thirty maniac will poke ahead of him like this, which is probably what I should be doing. I can see where beavers went out there. All right, I need three three thirties tomorrow, and my sled. That's fresh. I just cut that one off. There's something right there. Pretty good size hole. Plug it up, might catch an otter in there. Still got a week of otter trapping. No way, that's a tunnel. Holy crap. I just found it. It's right here. Wow. That's a unreal one right there. This ground is rock solid. I'd, I'd say that's the one I'm looking for right here. Never would have guessed it was in that root ball of that tree. Solid ground. You step over here, you sink. You step right here, you don't sink. There's another 330. Unreal, that's a good one. It might be hard to set that one, that's a wide hole. Hey, that's a good one there. All right, go get my beaver and see I'm sinking in the mud right now. Well over ankle deep of mud. Wow. That was a good one. The flood misplaced a lot of them. So they're probably starting to come in here more. All right guys, that's gonna be it. I'll get to the truck and I'll come back on. Stay tuned. Well guys, that's gonna be it for today. I, uh, I'll get a bit, another picture of the beaver on the tailgate when I get when I get back to the house. I gotta go give me something to eat. But uh, hey, I want to thank everybody for becoming a member. Not everybody, obviously, but I think I had 38 members. That's pretty awesome. And a lot of people are still asking how to become a member. If you go next to my subscribe button, it'll say join. Click on there and just follow what it, and check out my perks. I'm gonna be doing a monthly giveaway and stuff like that. So I just put some. Uh, canvas prints on my teespring for uh this a trapper j i um, put them on there because i'm gonna i'll order them from there when i do a giveaway i'll just i'll just order it straight off of there and then have them shipped to whoever wins so and there's some trapper j pillows on there so just trying to help people out that are trying to help me i want to give back so appreciate everybody uh, i'm on my phone now so it's probably a little bouncy cruising down the interstate so hey guys Hopefully I, I can have some more catches tomorrow. I'm gonna branch out and start catching beaver. It just depends on the temperature. I need the spring to be here, you know, make them caster mount sets really work. 
stick with me. We'll get back in the swing of things, start pumping out some videos. So, glad you guys are all here. Later.